Hi, my name is Shannon McGee. I am a native of the upstate. I've lived in Greenville for 30 some odd years. I live in the North Main area and I am fortunate enough to be one of the 12 uh, artists that are in a group called Oye Studios. It's at 37 East Hillcrest Drive, just off of North Main Street. I, uh, I share a space with a young uh, uh, metal sculptor artist uh, named James McSherry in the basement of the church. And um, uh, my main uh, uh, medium is uh, Italian marble plaster. I lived in Europe uh, a couple of years, went to college there and then taught uh, at a high school and was uh, always walking, walking, walking all through a lot of the old streets and stuff all over Europe. And uh, years later, I, uh, I started doing some artwork after having had an antique store on Main Street and down in the West End before its time. Um, and uh, I started doing some concrete and wall finishes and that led to um, a whole new line of work and then uh, a few years ago as I started getting older and climbing up and down scaffolds was uh, painful. Uh, still is, I still do it some, but um, I decided that uh, maybe I needed to work on something that I could just sit at a table and work at. So I do on canvas and board and other medium, I use uh, Italian marble plaster, which is a uh, ground pulverized lime to which uh, marble flour and in some cases pigments are added. And it is typically troweled at a home. I'm going to trowel it on a wall. On a board, I'm going to trowel it onto the board. This is a white paste. Um, I can then enhance the color with some mineral washed pigment, which this is a, a yellow umber uh, or ochre uh, mineral pigment that's washed onto it. Um, there, this is something where pigment is added into the mix, these two colors. And I also, um, a lot of times will then wash over an acid stain, which changes the color of the white or even the pigmented things and, and gives you some very interesting color variations that you just can't get by layering things on. So here are some examples. Um, we uh, have a website for Oye Studios. It's O-Y-E-S-T-U-D-I-O-S-G-V-L.com. Oye Studios Greenville, and we will be open um, in the month of November. Um, we're requesting that you make appointments with artists you'd like to visit just so we can keep the numbers safe for COVID. And uh, the weekend of the original open studios, we do plan to, to be open Saturday and Sunday, and uh, most of the other days of the month would be... Um, um, a, an appointment type situation. Thank you very much and we look forward to seeing you.